you have operatives in Egypt? Well, how am I supposed to know? All I know is we need to find this guy fast and quietly before Sarah gets any crazy ideas. Yeah, you're right. FBI, I need to ask you a few questions. I'm not who you're looking for. Well, is this your photo? Well, I think it is. Well, it seems like uh, there's no way out. I think it's something I need to work on. I've been to Iraq twice, and I've never seen you like this before. What's wrong? I'm pregnant. Don't you? Anyway, about the photo you gave me? Shh, shh, shh. Okay, how about you just swing by the office tomorrow morning and just tell me everything about it? Okay. You can't stop me. Well? You and I, we both know that you are not going to accomplish what you came for. I'm doing to them what you did to the Iraqi people. So what the fuck you were doing in Iraq in the first place? You went there with the sole purpose of killing innocent people. And that's what you signed up for. But it was all lies. Only the innocent people ended up dead. Oh, that's great. So you came here for revenge so you can kill more innocent people. So tell me something. What's the difference between you and those who made Iraq the hellhole it is? What's the difference between you and I? I'll tell you. I win. You lose. Clinton alive. Do you think I give a fuck about what Clint wants? What? Do you think I'm crazy? Do you think I'm making up fights on the street so my face can look like this? Today, I took a life of a man who in different circumstances could have been a friend. Why? Because it's the right thing for everyone's safety including our future child. And that's why I'm out there, Sarah. Oh my God. We just did a hit and run. Yep. Yup. That man died because of me. There's a dead man in our trunk and you're acting like nothing happened. Do you want to explain a dead body to a judge? That was an accident. There was no fucking witnesses. They have CSI tech stuff. They don't need to have witnesses. And don't yell at me. Listen, going to jail won't bring him back. Plus, you will not last a day in prison. Trust me. You said you took care of it. I knew they would find him. They always do. You knew? I did it on purpose. What do you mean you did it on purpose? I thought you said you didn't want me to go to jail. You don't understand. I didn't want us to live in fear every single time the door knocks. Think about it. He was a serial killer. He did humanity a favor and they didn't even know it. They found the body. It's over. It can't lead to us. Did you see? It's perfect. I know. Yo, what's up? Yo, G Lally. 
I need those passports and those airplane tickets now. Okay, come over. I get everything ready. Where are you going? I don't give a shit. I need to leave the country now. Sounds like you want to go to Europe. Any specification? Are you listening to me? I need to leave now. I don't give a fuck. Okay, okay. No need to yell. What about I get you the tickets and meet you directly at the airport? In an hour? Yeah, I'll be there. But three tickets in a short notice like that will cost you an extra 10k on top of what you already paid. You are picking the worst time to rip me off, motherfucker. Bro, you asking for something really expensive. It's normal to pay the price. I'll have your money. I'll see you in an hour.